Thank you, Madam Speaker. And I don't wish to detain the House at uh, great length tonight, but I do think it's appropriate as Leader of the House that I say a few words uh, about the retirement of the member for Griffith. Proverbs uh, has a statement in it that uh, to those whom much is given, much is expected. The member for Griffith is a highly intelligent individual, uh, a tremendous communicator, uh, a man of great passion and ability, and he could have turned all of those talents uh, to any kind of path in life. He could have been a very successful CEO of a business and earned tremendous amounts of money. He could have been a tremendous academic in one of Australia's many tremendous institutions. But he chose to pursue public life because for him, like I hope for all of us in this chamber, parliament is the highest form of public service. There are so many things a person of uh, Kevin Rudd's talents could have done, and yet he put through, he put his family through, and himself through what we all know uh, is a very tough life. Uh, I am the father of four children, still happily married, only after 19 years, unlike the 32 years of uh, Kevin and Therese, but we all know the extraordinary sacrifices that families make in this place to support their fathers, their husbands, their wives, their partners, to pursue public service. It is in so many respects a very selfish life, but in, all, in so many respects it's a selfless life as well. And so it's important to pay tribute tonight in a public way to a person who rose to the highest office in the land of the 13th biggest economy in the world, a very significant country, not just in our region but in the world, to become leader of a great party, whether it is the Liberal Party or the Labor Party, is a tremendous achievement. To lead that party to victory, to secure the confidence of the Australian people, uh, is a crowning glory. Nobody can ever take that away from the member for Griffith. And while I have called him all sorts of names over the years in this place, some of them more memorable than others, as part of the cut and thrust of this chamber, uh, on a personal basis, I've never had a crossword with the member for Griffith. And I will reveal a secret tonight, now that he's retiring. He and I were once both members of the same prayer group in this place. Uh, and 13 years ago, when my twins were born, after a very difficult pregnancy and a long period of time getting there, the member for Griffith could not have been more supportive for me as a human being. So his words tonight, when he said, take care of each other, uh, in spite of the argy-bargy that goes on in this place, we are all human beings, and I'm so pleased to be able to give Kevin Rudd back to his beautiful family and his wife, uh, and I'm sure that he has decades ahead of a contribution to public life in one respect or another, but also putting his family first uh, into the future. Well,